Happening now, the British Airways Concorde is on the move. Live look at Chopper 2 as the historic jet is leaving the Intrepid Museum for a few months to undergo some repairs. The Concorde became the fastest commercial aircraft in the world. CBS News' Christina Fan is live on Manhattan's west side with more. Christina, good afternoon. <laughs> Mary, a very exciting day, but in stark contrast to how fast we know the Concorde can travel, today's journey down the Hudson River is going to take much, much longer. It took several hours this morning just to crane and lift it off of Pier 86 onto this barge, and right now it's only just beginning to move. The supersonic jet will now be headed to a Brooklyn shipyard. The journey expected to take about two hours, depending on the tide, just 52 minutes less on the Concorde. Concord's record setting flight from New York to London back in 1996. The British Airways supersonic jet has been at the Intrepid Museum since 2003, and this is the first time it's leaving for restoration work. Lots of excited spectators were here snapping photos. They never had the opportunity to fly aboard a Concorde, so they say this was the next best thing. I remember the first Concorde flight. I think it's fabulous. I think it's just incredible and exciting and piece of history. No, I had never seen it up close, so, but it's pretty cool. It's really cool to see this amazing piece of engineering. It's a cool shape. It's pointy. And museum curators say the plane will be undergoing meticulous treatment, including the removal of its paint coating and also interior inspections for corrosion. The restoration process is expected to take around three months, and then the Concorde will make its way back right here to its home at the Intrepid Museum. For now, reporting live from the West Side, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. All right, Christina, thank you so much.